Lewandowski. Lewandowski, wow! What a finish that is! The Liga Player of the Month for February is here, guys, and it is Robert Lewandowski. Only 87 and 85 rated squads for him with no team of the weeks required. Let's put him into a team and see how he plays. Are you tired of coming up against absolutely insane teams? Well, today I've got a solution for you. Welcome to LootBar.gg, the fastest, safest, and most reliable, as well as cheapest coins I have seen for FC24. You can receive your coins as fast as 30 minutes, and also they offer full refunds if you're not happy with the product. Here is me making an order of 100,000 coins. As you can see, as we go across to the game, I've only got 489,000 coins. I also got a message from the customer service team and they told me exactly what I need to do to get my coins. And there we have it guys, just like that, in about 20 minutes I have received my 100,000 coins. Not only that, they offer 24 seven customer support. So if you do need help with your order, you are in good hands. You can also trust lootbar.gg with a 4.6 rating on Trustpilot and absolutely amazing reviews, which you can see right now on your screen. So if you want to upgrade your team on FC24, make sure you go to lootbar.gg, link in the description. Right, so here is Robert. Lewandowski, four star, four star, controlled lengthy with a basic chem style, six foot one as well. Can play striker and centre forward only. And of course, Barcelona links are very, very tasty for this card. He's got finesse shot, chip shot, power shot, and power header plus. No playstyle plus other than power header, which is a bit annoying. He's got incisive pass, which is a bit mad for him. He's also got first touch and Traveller. I think this card looks quite good. You know, for the price as well, I think it's very, very well priced. I think a lot of people are going to think an engine for this card. Now, I'm not sure on the Hawk, but I like the idea of making him mostly lengthy, which he is with the Hawk applied, as you can see right there. He gets a good pace upgrade with this as well, up to 87 pace. Gets maxed out on attack position and finishing shot power, and also up to 94 long shots with 96 penalties. 99 for his jumping, 97 strength, and also 93 aggression. He's already got good passing, 84 vision, and 87 short pass with okay curve at 82. Free kick accuracy is up to you if you care or not. I know he's got cool animations in game for his free kicks, I'm pretty sure. His dribbling is actually really good, guys. They've upped it quite a lot. He's got 82 agility and 88 balance, which I think is actually quite kind for him. 96 reactions, 93 ball control, 90 dribbling, and 91 for his composure. So it's actually a really, really good card in terms of dribbling for the kind of player he is. Now, the way we're going to be playing with him, I think I want him to play as the right centre forward on not getting behind, stay forward and stay central. I'm going to whip crosses into him. I'm going to see what his finishing is like as well. Let's get into a few games and see what Robert Lewandowski can do. Alrighty then, guys. First game now coming up with Robert Lewandowski, as Thomas Muller would say. Let's see what he can do, guys. I'm... I'm quite interested by this card because I actually quite like lengthy players on this game. I think they're very, very good and very underutilized, actually. Straight away there, left stick dribbling felt okay. Here he is, straight away here. Oh, yes, please. Oh, if I green that. I should have maybe power shotted that one, actually. Where does he sit from corners? He's the one right there, and I'm bad at corners, but that is a good corner. Oh, that was a really good corner for me. If you guys what? Oh, it's another good corner. Wow. I just went over his Swede there, didn't it? Good start, though, guys. Um, I don't think, straight away, he feels that bad. You know, I know a lot of people might look at him pace-wise and go, nah, no thanks. But what you have to think about, how often do you play against Harry Kane? The, the 93 versions. I think he's got two 93s. Nice. Oh, a good chance to test out his crossing here. Or not his crossing, his heading ability. There you go. Oh, that was really going. That was really whipping, wasn't it? Well, let's cross again. Robert Lewandowski. Oh. What is that? What a save. No. I want it on Lewis' head. Oh, I've just got a bang this. Sorry. Oh. Jesus Christ. I don't know how we've not scored. <laughs> I don't know how we've not scored. That's a mad start to this game, isn't it? But we're here for Lewandowski. And, yeah, I, I feel like... If you like Harry Kane, you're going to quite like this card. You know, Harry Kane's got some properties that are arguably a little bit better. First of all, he... Can I please get near the ball? Thank you. He has long ball pass, which is actually very, very OP on this game. Nice. Because again, with that mostly lengthy. And you can kind of disregard the fact... Jesus, he actually feels really fast here. Bang. Oh. 
I really don't know how we haven't scored, lads. Hold on. Go on, Oberdorf. Go on, Never. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. That is so cheesy. How's he done that? How's he done that? I've actually lost my train of thought there as well, guys. That's a bit mad. That is a bit mad. Um, but, yeah. You know, K Kane has a few things that are better. And Lewandowski also has a few things that are better on him as well. I do quite like his pass. I think his pass has been quite good so far. And I've... I actually think he feels quite fast. That's why I like the Hawk on him. You know, whilst it out of possession, he isn't going to feel rapid. Once he gets going, he is going to absolutely zoom, guys. Winners, winners, winners. Yeah, he is going to be so good, isn't he? I've got a funny feeling this card is going to be amazing. Wow. Look at the strength there. Nice, Lewandowski. Oh, wow. Wow. Well, first game done, guys. Let's get into another. Now, talking more as well, guys, about the kind of comparison to Kane. Kane's a little bit bigger, I want to say. He's got a bigger body type in game. But what Kane doesn't have is four-star skills. Where Lewandowski has four-star skills. Now, of course, Kane has the five-star weak foot. But you can actually compare these two quite quite similarly, in my opinion. But I do really like the lengthy on this uh, Lewandowski. I think it makes him... Oh, my days. What? Wow. Now, he, he isn't the fastest, right? But once he gets going, because of the mostly lengthy, he is fast. Oh, my God. We've got another rage quit. Let's get into another game. Right then, guys. Here we go with the third game now coming up with Lewandowski. And I have to say, even though he's not really my kind of player, I do like the aerial players. I think they're quite important on this game. I have to say I'm quite impressed. Now, he's an absolutely incredible finisher, right? absolutely incredible finisher you can't hold that away from him he, he, you know a lot of the shots that i've been taking have been you know either yellow timed or not timed at all and they're absolutely flying in any way so that's a, po a positive straight away right exactly the same as as h who i keep comparing it, this card to okay buddy <laughs> okay buddy yeah he, he, you know K kane is an insanely good finisher and this Lewandowski feels as good as kane finishing wise Ooh, nice. Into Lero again here. Nice and back back into it maybe here too. Yes. Lewandowski. Lewandowski. Wow. What a finish that is. Now, I've used that Harry Kane quite a lot, guys. Especially on my road to glory. The 93 team of the tournament one and also the honourable mention. This card feels like it's got better finishing. This guy's a demon as well. I can tell by the way he plays. Nice. Well in, Kessler. I'm going to try and get this into Lero again. Try and get it on his Swede. No problem at all. He is going to be amazing. I, I, oh, my God. I have to say, guys, I think this card's going to be awesome. See if he can find out. Because he's got... Inst Wowzers. I don't know if he had incisive pass on his gold or his road to the knockout. But it feels quite OP. You know, for, for a card like this to have that. It does feel like a crazy card, you know. And I do think the position we're playing him in is the best. So he's always on his strong foot, no matter what. Um, Nice, good play. Really nice football there. Yeah, he's always on his strong foot, no matter what. Ooh, oh, I thought maybe we might have seen a bit of change there out of him against Virgil. This is a messy game, man. This guy's decent. And it's, it's, it's like strange the way the game's playing here. Pretty predictable, buddy. I'm not going to lie. Let's try and send it into him. He's up against... Who is it? You're dodgy down here, right? He is insanely good in the air. I don't know how Modric hasn't controlled that. Oh, my days. Oh, what a mess. What a mess, eh? Here we go, though. There was making that run. I'm going to look for him as well. Back into Frimpong. There was making that run again. It's a good ball from Frimpong. Oh, I tried to sprint boost there into the space. I thought that might have worked there. I'm impressed, though, guys. I am impressed. I'm impressed. Wow, he feels so strong. Look at that. Okay, don't R1 dribble with him. <laughs> yeah, you're not going to get much out of that, guys. But my God. Because he's lengthy. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. What a finish. If you know how to do the step over like sprint boost stuff, you'll love this card. I, I am shocked by how good his finishing is. It feels better than Kane's. Like, truly, truly it does. Send it over to him again. Winners, no problem at all. Yeah. 
Yeah, man. Now, what an awful pass that was from Modric. This this card feels good, guys. Let's go to some highlights. Oh, my God. He's an absolute pit bull. Yes. Yes! Oh, he's actually amazing! What? This is actually a must-complete SPC. Even if you don't like this kind of player, he's so cheap, and he's 92 rated. Come on, then. Let's see it. Let's see it. I dare you. Oh, never mind. Trevor has been nerfed too much. Nice. There is there again. Lewandowski. Very nice. Four goals for him in this game, guys. All right, then, guys. So, review is in on La Liga Player of the Month, Lewandowski. What a card for what a price as well. You know, if you don't even like this kind of card, I feel like for the price, he's an absolute no-brainer. You know, 87 rated squad and an 85 rated squad with no informs required. Probably like 150k, maybe a bit cheaper than that. I'm not entirely sure. What this card offers is finishing like Harry Kane's team of the year honourable mention. The ability to be mostly lengthy as well, which is really underrated on this game. Go and watch the highlights and you will see me utilise it really, really well. Insane finisher, decent pace, especially with the mostly lengthy once he gets going off the step overs. Feels really, really fast and it's hard to stop pace wise. Has very, very decent passing. The incisive pass is something that adds to this card. And just before we carry on, I want to see if his gold or his any of his other cards has incisive pass because I feel like it doesn't. But if it does, it does, right? Let's go and take a look. So this one, okay, so he's always had incisive, which is interesting. They've given him no extra play styles, which is a little bit jarring. Um, but, you know, if you don't have the road to the knockout, I feel like this card is amazing. His passing is good. You know, because he can do the incisive pass passes, he's able to find them over the tops that are really hard for strikers to find. His dribbling is good. His arm on dribbling isn't very good, but his left stick dribbling is okay. And he does feel like he's got 82 and 88 agility and balance. So he's not too bad in that sense either. The reactions is a great thing for him as well, guys. He feels really, really responsive for a big man. And, of course, he is crazy good in the air. The stamina doesn't matter, especially on a striker. It really doesn't. And the physical, you know, the strength is also a really nice addition. I feel like if you want to have a bit of fun, this Lewandowski is a lot of fun to play with. And not only is he a lot, he a lot of fun to play with, he's actually good in game. You know, pace is good, especially if you try and make him mostly lengthy. Finishing, unreal, like the best on the game type finishing. Good passing, especially for a striker. Very good dribbling for a big man, six foot one, with power header and insane strength. And, you know, he's insanely good in the air with incredible strength to hold off defenders and fullbacks. I would certainly recommend, guys, playing him in a 4-3-2-1, 